Photography came about through love for music and spending time with my mates and going out to parties. And I realized that sort of my passion for music and photography kind of allowed me to get closer to that. For me, Manchester was a no brainer. As a student here, I had like the, some of the best nights of my life. Manchester's like not changed. It's got such a, a strong legacy. What was going on back in like the 80s or like the early 90s when the youths were sort of using partying to sort of escape from, I guess, the real world and the sort of the stresses of their normal sort of day to day lives. And I think you can draw comparisons to what's going on right now. Being a part of an event like the Warehouse Project was special. Through my photos, I wanted to sort of tell sort of stories and show this sort of side of, I guess, like events that people usually don't get to see. Peter Walsh inspired me to start shooting on film at the Warehouse Project. It hadn't really been done before either, which I found interesting. It opened my eyes up to the fact that you don't need to sort of create these perfectly composed shots. I think with photography, the most important thing is people seeing an image and it sort of like speaking to them and people feeling sort of emotions from that. Seeing my work on um, the Made in Manchester campaign by Apple is sort of come full circle for me personally, as Manchester is where I sort of started off in my career. Yeah, it's quite fitting just to, to be recognised as a photographer and seeing my work sort of printed out is, is something that will never sort of get old. Surrounding myself around people down in London who are creative and driven and motivated and being able to sort of share my skills and have friends share their skills with me is, is what it's all about. Being able to take photographs of them, whether it be press shots or single artworks, any way that photography can be used for them. Living with Adam, who's very much involved in the London uh, music scene as a DJ, he's given me many opportunities to become involved in that and use my photography to, to sort of help document that. And I think that's sort of the community and being welcomed into other areas um, is, yeah, is key to sort of helping everyone progress together. I'm Rob Jones, freelance photographer.